I bought this uh, I just bought this player let's try to silence this first okay um, this is a 10.1 inch uh, Android player comes with a 8 core 16 gig of uh, space and uh, 2 gig of RAM I think that's enough um, got it for 1002 inclusive of installation 1002 ringgit so when it comes the launcher or the user interface doesn't look like this I've actually paid another 10 ringgit on to buy this launcher from Android store the Play Store it's called the uh, Agama car launcher so it's 9 ringgit 70 cent like that lah, around so the main reason is that this user interface uh, is much uh, user intuitive you know user friendly and easy to 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 look it around you know to, to, to look for the apps that I want the previous one is only you know one side is uh, music another side is radio and that's about it in the middle is time then you everything else you need to actually go into the apps and look for it one by one well on this one it's much more straightforward um, as you can see you can have radios here so if you have more than one radio you know then this is an internet radio then you can just you know put it here and you can add two more if you have another two more radio apps so this is the uh, maps you just slide it then you can see that you can aim more maps but I only use this two for for the moment and uh, as for music you know this is the default music player it comes with the 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 player itself uh, then I have the jukes and also this we sing so this one will let me you know, sing karaoke um yeah so let's go through another one this is video um where i have a youtube here and this is a club tv not sure you can see this so this this one will enable me to watch several hundreds of uh tv channels you know not too sure what else is in there later on you can you can just go and see for yourself lah. club tv and uh, this is the internet I think I'm just using Chrome here and for the rest you know this is an equalizer this is an easy connect for me to connect my Android and my iPhone it's more like a mirror link kind of thing lah. and uh, this is Play Store so in this simple interface you know you'll be able to see so many you know things in here so if you just want to go back to normal just, just press in the middle and uh, you get to see that this is uh, a clock so you can still change it if you want to change it to this this it will trace how fast you go you know based on the GPS that you have uh, you have a GPS device there uh, so this is also the GPS signal that you're getting 6, 7 you know depending on how good is your signal and this is of course uh, that I'm actually connected to my hotspot from my iPhone so without this you know without the internet connected you won't be able to use so many of these functions and uh, this is actually what oh, you call it Google speak what hello uh, find me food nearby okay I think I, I make it too slow let's try again open ways open ways so you can just open your ways by you know giving a voice command it's pretty convenient but I think I just can just swipe here and then you open yeah oh I just please press here that you still open okay let's get back to the home screen here okay so let's see I am still exploring this part so this will actually give me the clock this is the GPS thingy uh, where it show me the how, how fast am I going 
uh, this is actually music I think this is a default music player uh, somehow it's not synced to my my player default player for the Agama concert but mine is not synced to this anyhow and uh, this is the logo I believe you can still change to any other logos mine is a Nissan X-Trail that's why I chose Nissan this is a navigation it will show you the directions when it's going around you know when you need to turn then you start to turn uh, show you the sign that you need to turn or you turn so this is quite nice you know you don't have to always open the map you know because it will show it from here but so far I can only use Google map uh, because it's not linked to ways in any way okay this is the compass Mm, I don't think I need this anyhow it looks good so I think that's about it uh, yeah this is actually the the weather forecast not mistaken this is uh, 27 Celsius right now uh, Malaysia is pretty humid even it's dark outside it's still still quite hot yeah still quite warm so and as for this uh, I believe this is how you dim your uh, brightness of your screen so I think this is automatic automatic it will know that it's now 9 o'clock you know about 10 in the in the evening at night so it will give me a brighter screen if we click again this is night time you know it is not auto so uh, of course it's still be bright and this is daytime you know you can see that it's a uh, sun there okay so I think I just set it to auto so you automatically you know dim and whatever it is you know dim and give it brighter for me back so this is the setting this is Agama car launcher so my car is a Nissan therefore it give me a, automatically give me a Nissan logo so you can also change the theme uh, over here basically you don't change most of the interface you're just changing the colors of the buttons and the icons here so uh, say you like it to be in light blue or in for example purple you can do it like that and you can change your background for example you like this type of background all the dots and let's see what is you'd like to have a stitching lines and also you know some 3d backgrounds okay let's try so that's how it looks like after you have changed your team and uh, you can also show your icons Wi-Fi mobile internet and so on and so forth I don't think I want to show all I just show the Wi-Fi and GPS that comes default in it and let's see weather I think this is something that is just showing you it doesn't do anything quick button on the left right uh, left bottom where it's now got voice search I think this parking time is kind of useless for me and uh, the start camera it doesn't start my 360 view camera it, I got another button just for that so I'll just stick to this Google voice search and uh, volume control somehow it's not working on my unit here and I don't need another volume control buttons because I already have these two buttons here and I also can use my steering button to control so I'll just disable it otherwise it's just redundant and it looks a, a little bit cluttered you know with all the buttons there so screen brightness I think this I will just leave it as it is you know I won't do anything on it day brightness I, I don't think day brightness should be so anyhow I think you can't change it oh you can okay day brightness yeah too dim can't see anything night brightness maybe you get it a bit more uh, it's not I think that's a max okay auto brightness let it be and application menu 
I believe this uh, is the menu that you give you you get to see more grids I mean more more applications in the app in this apps button here see there's one two three four five six seven seven in a row say if I change it to where is that more than seven I put nine then you can see everything in one screen but the size of it is a little bit small so I think I'll just change it back to the default oh, sorry the default grid size I think five five will be good there six will be good so it's big enough for me to look at it when I'm driving sorry yeah six will be good Okay, let's look at the settings again okay so this is a boot animation so those with a slower you know uh, head unit build just one gig of RAM maybe you don't want to show your boot animation and also boot logos because it will just slow it down and it looks uh, sluggish so this I think mine is fine it's still new and a UI animation for better performance on yeah distance I put it into km not mouse temperatures in Malaysia using Celsius not Fahrenheit and uh, this is full screen so it will hide whenever I opened the UI I mean this this screen you won't see that these things here yeah it will auto hide Okay, what else? Auto layout. So I just leave it to to the to the system to you know, automatically you know make the screen full for me. Screen orientation for those who have those Tesla type of uh, screen. Maybe you want to rotate to ninety degrees. Mine is just normal uh, landscape. And uh, I believe you can also change your languages. There are so many of it. You know, I I just stick to my English. And uh, sleep mode. I not too sure what 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 does this do. I think it will just you know put everything into a sleep mode after a while. You know, when your power is off or your when your screen is off, then all your music will be down as well. And uh, home screen. So my home screen, will, of course, will be this uh, car launcher. Yeah, it's already set that way anyway. Let's get back to my settings. And uh, run on top. Yeah. So I just make sure that this is always on top, you know, the UI. Um, I think that's it. You know, the rest is feedbacks. And uh, that's all. And I'm running a full version. I paid nine ringgit and uh, seventy-five cent, I believe. Yeah. So whenever they have an update, I can also update it here. So I think that's about it. And uh, this is my best setting. I think I will just change back the, the colors because mine, my colors is in the fonts is in orange. So let's change it back to orange. I'll try to match back the colors uh, a little bit too much. Okay, I think it's about there. Darker. Okay. Yeah, it should be something like this. Yeah. Matches, right? Okay and uh, yeah okay I think that's that's it for now uh, yeah and uh, this is the radio default comes with this I think it's not uh, very clear so I will use an internet radio it's called shock 
it's an app from Astro so usually I'll just listen to this few yeah few radio stations so there you go that's my my FM okay so let's get back to the meter okay and uh, for, as for maps you know we can just open I think this is nothing to show about please uh, music come this app Simple apps, you, know, you can go to folders, whatever you want, and play the music. Yep, that's about it. And you can drag. Okay, let's get back to the home screen. Press here, and uh, YouTube is nice. Yeah, I've set it to one click report to YouTube so I can watch wherever I want over here and it's pretty smooth as well Power of dreams. yeah and quite fast as well I'm just using a uh, hotspot okay and as for internet it's Google Chrome nothing special you know yeah, it's loading the star it's a new portal from Malaysia and uh, I've shown you this before um, this is equalizer so I'm using this equalizers this is just nice for me this is the easy connecting easy connection where you can link to your Android using a USB or using Wi-Fi or as for the iPhone it's just Wi-Fi so this is basically a replacement for Android Auto and Android CarPlay of course you can't you know uh, uh, for the Android iPhone Wi-Fi you can't really uh, touch the screen and and it will respond from your phone it doesn't do that it is from the other way around you touch your phone then it's just mirroring what you're seeing here and as for Android USB I believe you can do that you can actually click here and your phone will follow I think this is just Play Store alright I think that will be it um, oh yeah and it will show you what you are actually watching I Just I just watch YouTube it will show you here if you're really listening to some music it will show you here as well so i think this is a, a very lengthy video that will be all oh, of course uh, there's some buttons here where i need to show you this is basically a button to mute the sound this is a home button this is a back button uh, this is the volume I prefer those button type but you know nowadays they come with touch sensitive buttons anyhow uh, it's a good I feel I feel pretty satisfied with this uh, Agama car launcher yeah. pretty nice I think that's about it thank you for watching uh, give it a thumbs up and uh, like this video and subscribe if you like this video thank you